about the difference between a neural lock and a lever lock. We're going to be talking about the knob lock and the braking technique. Sanders! Late. A locksmith should never be late. Your client's prosperity rests on your punctuality. Sorry, Mr. Frost. Don't let it happen again. As I was saying, the knob lock and the raking technique. Now this is a technique, it's not unsimilar to things we've already been doing. What kind of pick is used for raking? Bobby. Bobby, picks. Raking now. Uh, like in, like an ice pick? Did some, uh, attempt at a joke? Uh, yes, yes it is, sir. Oh, okay, well then, why don't you explain to me what's funny about a valued client being locked outside their house, Bobby? I, no, I, I don't, I don't know, sir. It's three-fourths. Why don't you write that down, son? Now, remember, the final assessment is coming up. The winner of which gets to be my esteemed apprentice. Now, only one of you can win this. And what that is, you're gonna be working for me for a year. Now, in addition to that, you also get this. Your own business card with my watermark on it. I can't believe I screwed up on that stupid question today. You know, I, I, I should just, I should just drop out. Don't be ridiculous. You've come this far. Besides, I think you'll be a great lock player. Really? Definitely. Oops. Sorry, Ice Pick. You're such a jerk. Listen, kids. My great granddaddy was a locksmith. My granddaddy and my daddy. I got locksmithing in my blood. I'm going to be working for Mr. Frost. BAM! You got this. It's in your blood. You got this. Where are you going, tool? What the hell? Oops, sorry, ice brick. Mr. Frost, they broke my glasses. I can't finish the exam. You have to let me retake it. By now, Mr. Boggs, you should be able to do this with your eyes closed. You don't get do-overs. You finish now or you don't. That's it. Take it or leave it. 